All right, hello friends. Uh, this is the fourth video I've recorded today, which is okay because I haven't recorded a video in like three weeks, so I'm a little behind. Uh, probably the last one today. Getting a little tired. Technically, um, the Yu-Gi-Oh! video is processing and rendering right now, so there's a good chance I could fuck up this recording or that um, video, so fun all around. But yeah, uh, I didn't originally plan on getting this game. I just didn't really have a huge interest. I gotta move myself. I just realized I'm like, I put my microphone low and I like was bending super low to do it. And I was like, it's bad. I shouldn't do that. <laughs> it's gonna kill my back. Uh, yeah, I originally wasn't planning to play this. Um, and then everyone kept talking about how good it is. And I keep seeing ads for it. So I'm like, all right, well. And some of the stuff I've seen out of context looks pretty cool. Um, we'll see if I actually care. Let's put Field of View out. I like to be as far away from my character as possible. I don't know if that's a me thing. Um, cool. I think it feels a little quiet. Well, that might just be part of this game. Also, I turned my volume down at some point, so... Look the difficulty of the game. The so only influence the game's battles and the story will be unaffected. You can choose the difficulty at any time for notions. These are really hard, can only be chosen here, and cannot be selected later on. You only get hard in the beginning? I'm sorry. Sucks to suck. Um, difficulty provides a smooth experience. I recommend a newcomer to the Shimagami Tensai series. Uh, difficulty provides a compelling, provides a compelling experience. I recommend to those familiar with the Shimagami Tensai series. Uh, difficulty full of danger and hardships. I recommend to those seeking an exceptional challenge. Really normal. I'm a normal boy. I'm a normal boy in a normal world. This is a work of fiction. Any names or characters, businesses, or incidents are fictitious. Any resemblance to actually per actual persons living or dead or actual events is purely coincidental. You know it's good when you start with that warning. While I contemplate the brevity of man's life, I am indifferent to worldly things. How many are the days I spend in thought? The man Yoshi. This is why we never should have converted him from a dinosaur. should have always stayed a companion. Becoming human gave him too much power. Oh, this guy looks pretty good. Um, for background, I've only played Jim Gummy Tensei 4. I've played Persona 3, 4, and 5. Platinumed all four of them. Or three of them. Three? Platinum, Persona 4, and then 5 and 5 Royale. Long ago, the world of um, I played a little bit of Jim Gummy Tensei 4 and, his servants, and couldn't get into it. The angels so, led it on its we'll see if this is different. Course. I saw these in the ad for the game, the the school outfits. Uh, these are rad as hell. <laughs> like, they might be my favorite outfits in any SMT game for uh, the school uniform. I fucking love those flowers on the uniforms. Even God's work is not eternal. SMT is like hardcore into religion and stuff, right? The whole thing in four was like demons versus angels, right? That God had forged will. As fate dictates, become a muddled, poisonous swamp at the hands of humankind. Yeah, those uniforms fucking rock. I love that they have pants for them too. Order begets chaos, and chaos will likewise be consumed by order. I wonder if I could find a shirt with that outfit, or with that uh, design, I should say. How will these? Keepers of knowledge strive and perish. Please tell me he's supposed to be American. Oh my god. <laughs> Let us watch them at our leisure until the new ruler is seated upon the throne. Funny enough, after I play this, I'm probably going to go back to either, uh, after I record this, I'll either go back to Tokyo Xanadu um, or start Trails of Cold Steel. Which is Bart and Rand uh, Persona and SMT. Everyone should have their own personal tablets now, but it sounds like some of you still need to get them registered. Ah, the clever device for those temp accounts are about to expire. This. So anyone who's been putting it off better get on that. Why is my battery thirty four percent? The school day just I guess it's three o'clock, right? We went through a whole day.
My first name is Nick. It's Ninjala. <laughs> no, it's, it's nitrogen fixing, yes. My last name is Zalus, like the Wrath of. One other thing. It's been getting pretty dangerous out there. Remember the buddy system. Go back to the dorm in groups. That's it for homeroom. Thank you, sir. So used to the PS5. This is a really first world problem, but I'm so used to the PS5, and whenever I see loading screens now, I'm like, ew, really? I was playing the um, or the PS4 version of Resident Evil 8, having almost platinum to the PS5 version, and there's loading screens that I never knew existed in the PS4 version. And I'm just like, ew. <laughs> this is disgusting. Students are advised to head home in groups. You should look for a classmate to walk with. We got three options. Alright, I know how the map works. Why did I seem really tall real quick there? Alright, let's see. My guess is that none of these three students are going to be ones that you can walk home with because they don't look detailed enough to be actual characters. The hint is that they don't have a face. <laughs> they have Persona 5 uh, hey, Syndrome. Hey. Right, first year got attacked in the station. Apparently Shadow huh? came right at her. Shadow, no. what do you mean? She said, oh, so, some kind of black fog. And touched her bag, and she got all torn up. Like literally, cuts started appearing from, from a knife. Nandato. All right, can I just leave? No, you're gonna make me talk to all three of them. I see you, sneaky hey. exposition. Uh, so you're talking to that geek from that class over. What's his name? Ishiro Dazai. Yeah. yeah. Uh, guess he's making videos trying to put together the web series. Asked me about the slasher instead mm. of the tunnel. So about some invisible guy with a knife makes you wonder what the real story is there. <laughs> Seems like that was Daisai's point. He's so gonna solve the mystery of the slash and trying to really hype himself up, you know? Hi, you're blocking the door, but your outfit is impeccable. Hey there! Uh, biggest name of this school is gonna be uh, Yuzuru. Uh, Yuzu Atsura, right? Uh, the honor student from Class B, I guess he's the best we got in the academics, yeah. <laughs> There's a girl to be Tao Isonokami. Right, she's smart, a great athlete, nice, she's got it all. Hey. Hey, I'm smart, I'm athletic, I'm nice. Sometimes a symbol will be displayed on the minimap that's an objective marker. I have played a video game before, thank you. Everything alright? Oh my god, I hate the faceless stuff. Just please stop. Male student D. <clears throat> uh, going on a group seems like a right pin in the ass. Uh, so I'm just gonna go on alone. If you can't find anyone else, maybe you should do the same, huh? Alright, man, thanks. I can tell I'm a main character because I have eyes. Hey, you heading back alone? This character has eyes. They must be a main character. User Atsura or Atsuda. It definitely was an R before, right? I'm not losing my mind. You should walk with us. Oh, what is the what is this? Oh, okay. I was like, I hate that they're both uh, like that. Yeah, sure, why not? Am I a fully sound protagonist? Oh god, I hate hey, the games are still doing this. In twenty twenty one, the year of our Lord. Tao Izonokami. What a godly like being. Oh, um, hi there. Miyazu Atsuda. Oh, it's a sibling to glasses. I hate their eyes. I didn't know you knew him, Miyazu. I mean, not really. Oh, wait. Am I a dude? They've met in passing. I think what? Miyazu and I ran into him a couple times. I thought the main character in this game was a girl. Something like that. Did it just assume my gender from Aww. picking Nick? That's not fair. You're lucky your big brother looks out for you so much. Oh, wait, or am I going to die and then it's going to turn out I have a sister? I guess. I really thought I was a girl this entire time. My eyelashes are way too effeminate. I don't think it's that strange. I mean, whatever. I'm whatever my character decides to identify as. 
<laughs> sure, sure. So, how about we all walk home together? I should mention, genuinely, uh, I know nothing about this game. I've seen, like, snippets of, like, some of the stuff. Uh, like, seeing Mara has made a return, seeing some of the demons uh, and the special interactions they have. That's it. I've, I don't know how the gameplay works. I don't know how the story works. I know nothing. Why is the dorm so far from the school? That seems like bad uh, design. Okay. I almost wonder if SMT5 is like a tech test for Persona 6. In a way. I know this game has been hyped up by like the hardcore crowd, but Persona, like without a doubt, sells more. So I almost wonder if they're like testing mechanics here before they uh, bring them back. I feel like they did that with the SMT4. They oh, did some right. um, Tell. some mechanics. Or it was like it was way more thick, and they oh, they made Persona Five right. more SMT-like because I've of it. Just been having these weird dreams lately. Like, is any of this for real or not? This distant voice, like someone far away is calling out to me. It keeps getting closer and closer, but just when it seems like they've almost found me, I wake up. And I keep having that dream every night. Kind of getting to me. I wish someone could tell me what it all means. Probably a reflection of something subconscious. Maybe you're just stressed over the future. It would make sense since... Yo, we got a dead person? Hell yeah. They have some slash marks because that's the only bit of info I've gotten about this, uh, this world. Seems like something's happened at the station. You should take a look. Should I? Thanks. I don't want to talk to the people. They're just going to tell me some nonsense. Hey! <laughs> I heard someone got eaten. Huh? Hey, look. It's hard to tell blood everywhere, though. I'm going to record this. It's going to blow up online. It's like something happened over here. Uh, the onlooker's talking about it. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to say, can I sneak by? But probably not, right? This seems like a really big scene to set up in a crowded uh, train station. Surely you can, like, make that blue tarp a square and at least let foot traffic still pass on the left and right. That seems kind of insane. Especially in Japan. Oh, hi. My brother came back, but he then Tao got a message, too. <laughs> uh... Which I know he's always looking after. Okay. Thanks. I'll, I'll just wait here. <clears throat> By the way, the uh, the dialogue screen for when that shows, like when someone's talking, like I'll try and bring it up right here. Huh? Uh, deeply unsettles me. <laughs> the, the like weird black fog slash smoke in the background is uh, I don't know, it gives me the heebie-jeebies, which I guess is probably the point. Do you guys know how, how I know I'm a real gamer? I tried running. Oh, it has auto run? Ugh. I hate auto run. Just make it sprint. Oh, here we go. He <laughs> just. <laughs> so, uh, on the left stick is auto run. Uh, holding R2, or whatever it is on the Switch controller, is, uh, is sprint. I think that's the same as, uh, I think that's the same as Judgment in Yakuza. Oh, this, I've made a mistake. I'm looking on my TV screen, and it's in, it's up, up res to 60 FPS, and it's not on my uh, my preview screen. Would I like to save? Sure. Right, where did he go? No, oh, I found him. He's over here. He went a long way to make a phone call. I feel like the spacing on this map is weird and kind of out of whack. Are you telling me the American is the one who wants to make this miniseries? Oh my god, please. Don't do this to me. Alright. So word on the street is a bunch of monsters have been seen hanging around this tunnel. Ichiro Daizai. 
with either pimples or freckles. They look like pimples. Uh. <laughs> Ceiling's pretty low. I shouldn't laugh, but I did. Pretty dark in here too. What a dumb Looks thing dangerous. to do. I did say to walk home with people. Five meters. I think it's like six feet, isn't it? Give or take. All right. Not even. That looks Enough like more like four, uh, five feet. Let's go even deeper, yeah? I think we might be onto something big. Hey, I gotta be honest. You're kind of like doing some stuff that you can do later. It seems like you're like. Hey, what are you doing here? You should just be like. You can leave in the editing block. Every time I see one of these now loading screens, I'm just like, you you couldn't bring this to other consoles? You couldn't you couldn't bring this to PlayStation or Xbox or PC? It had to be on the Switch. We're, we're sure. Okay. Just making sure. Well like we're really sure, okay. Why is knowledge a proper noun here? Upon the throne of creation. He sees all knowledge from the other gods, rebuking them so they could never dare. I feel like this isn't mixed very well. I feel like the background music is way louder than the dialogue. Reducing them to mere demons. The fruit of knowledge was secreted away in a paradise of his own creation. One day, a serpent sought out the mortals, seeking to tempt them into doing his will. Eat the fruit of knowledge in this paradise, and you will become more like God. This is obviously a mishmash of a bunch of different uh, religion stuff, and I know that SMT is like big into religion, but uh... Relying a little too heavily on the Judeo-Christian stuff, because I find that shit very overplayed. The mortals of each realm ate the fruit. One after another, without fail. The knowledge they devoured then bound to their souls, birthing humans closer to gods. When the god of law saw this, he banished all humanity from his paradise in a fit of rage. I seem like a cutscene that would be near. And then never spoken of again. Because <laughs> that's how near works. Curious creatures infused with precious knowledge. Foggy now title screen? Were okay. Observed by countless demons, waiting for their chance to strike. Yo, but you got Sakura trees here? Even in uh, December? It's pretty impressive. Can't be all bad. I know I've said it multiple times, but this uh, this outfit is fucking awesome. Unironically, I think it's really cool. Especially as a uniform. That's that's really rad. Better than like just plain black up. Oh. Didn't touch my controller in, in uh, too long. How can this be? A human walks among us. I don't think I recognize this one. This is no place for one such as you. I shall grant you sanctuary. Fortunate an angel of Bethel found you, 
Were it an agent of chaos in my stead, you may not be alive. Remain calm and keep still. You will be safe momentarily. I don't recognize this, uh, this angel. And I've completed the compendium in Persona 4 and 5. So I know a lot of, like, the recurring ones. I don't know the, uh... I mean, to be fair, it's also been a while since I've completed the compendium. I didn't do it for Royal, so... It's been at least since, like, 2016, 2017. On one hand, I do like the idea of a character just kind of giving up. Because I'm like, this, like, a situation is just too insane. Because it is realistic. But I'm also like... A video game or a story, you need a call to action. Like, <laughs> just you need to be a certain kind of person to be a protagonist. Also, I can't imagine the sand is gonna um, is gonna work very well on a uh, YouTube. So if you find the quality dropping around this section, it's probably because uh, I don't know. Okay, well, it's still a little bit. It probably doesn't like it. Alright. Can't wait for my tutorial fight once I hit that point in the middle. This reminds me more of Astral Chain, which is not an Atlas property, I don't think. That's a Platinum Games property. We can keep talking about all the different games it reminds me of instead of anything to do with, like, just assuming the game didn't do anything in original itself. I'm the worst kind of person, you know? Oh, I don't know that I recognize those ones either. Yo, am I gonna get a Digimon? Oh, I'm so excited. Young man, if you wish to live, take my hand. I I want to live. I think you can forgive me for thinking that you played as a female protagonist. Unless that's what just happened. I was right. I knew this is where the tutorial fight would be. A little, a little bit of a banger. I think this game is a little more crisis than it intended. 
like Crisis 2 and 3 specifically. You're not Arsene or Izanagi. Uh, Alright. I was going to say, are we using proper terms? What is this? All attacks from the medical flash have been critical hits for all allies for one turn. Interesting. And Zio. Uh, yep, I know how affinities work. This team is an actual banger, though. I should, uh, not kill this thing instantly. I should try and look at its, uh, information screen and showing. Okay, so it's basically it's a simple thing. It just tells you what its, uh, strengths and weaknesses are. So it looks like we got the standards of fire, ice, lightning, and wind, and we have dark and light, it looks like. I think that's, uh, that's toned down from, uh, Persona 5. We also have physical attacks. Ooh, this screen's rad. A lot of info here. I think I like the design of this better than the Persona uh, series. I think it looks a little cleaner. Um, I have defense against light, I'm weak against dark, and wind, that is standard. Um, oh, okay, so here we go. There are four other things next to dark and light, but maybe they're just status effects? That's odd. Oh, and skill points? Oh, shit, dude, this is already more in-depth than Persona. Uh, alright, we'll go with strength. It's a safe bet early on in the games. All hostile targets eliminated. That was a horde of demons. Additionally, this place is what is correct. Descended. Furthermore, this is home. But do not worry. I, Proto Fiend Algami, am here. Together, we have become a being known as a Nahobino. Let us keep this. I'd like you to go here. Wait, but why couldn't you just do it? Why do we have to combine? Why couldn't you have just like? kept kicking ass on your own. Is this a uh, bravely default situation? You're going to betray me? How dare you. I'm wise to your machinations. This is pretty rad. Um, I like that it's... Uh, of course you Naruto run. Of course you do. Now I know it should be called ninja running, but I think Naruto ruined it for the rest of us. This world is filled with Magatsuhi. Brimming with spiritual power, it is the source of a demon's strength. Why did he say- why is this the second Kingdom Hearts line? This world is filled with darkness. The lights you see around us. What? what lights? Young, perhaps you aren't accustomed to your new bo- Interesting. Why are the different colors? Were you able to see them? Magatsuhi can give us strength as well. Three colored lights that can be seen on the map are called Magatsuhi. Green is HP, yellow is MP, uh, red is special skills. I really think yellow should have been blue. MP is blue. I don't like that they made it yellow in this. This is something. I guess this is to like... Um, heal you between battles? Oh, I like the hair effects. They must have, they must have gone to the, uh, the bane of the devs. Usually hair doesn't look that, uh, that good in games, especially Switch games. No double jump? What's the point? Why even bother making a game if you can't double jump? I'm kidding, I don't really care. Yeah. Modern Maka. Which just turned into money. Which is odd. Well, yeah, I was going to say, am I going to a new area? Hmm. 
Observe, young man. I've heard that this place was once known as Tokyo. Hmm, I'm afraid I lack the date. All I can remember is that there was a... Two great forces clashed right here. Despite this, however, the data containing my memory. Young man, perhaps we... If we return to the last location... Interesting. I am starting to get chilly over here, I should mention. My, uh, my heat's broken in my living room. Uh, it broke, like, the day my vacation started. Um, and, like, everyone who, like, all the maintenance team is, like, on Christmas break. I was like, this is great. It works in my, uh, my room, though. Mm -hmm. So I just basically have it cranked up there, and then I just have it, like, kind of, like, the door open, and it's spreading out. But my desk is, like, as far away from my, my bedroom door as possible. So it gets a little chilly over here. After comparing this blue pillar of light, it's a safe point. I've played a video game. Come on. Found is a point from which the not only can it heal those considering the damage. Oh wait, I guess it's, uh, it's a healing point. And a teleport. Please tell me his sunglasses on. You want to know where you are? <laughs> Why, this is the place I call home. As you can plainly see, I'm a bit of a collector of sorts. It's easy living. What with the riffraff out there and me in here. <laughs> Still, a demon like you's a first. One body, sure, but I can sense two spirits within, no doubt about it. <laughs> Pleasure having you. Do you know why this is bugging the shit out of me? I'm pretty sure this is the same voice actor as uh, Cicero from Skyrim. And I fucking hate Cicero. I find him a very annoying character. I'm really hoping I don't f find the same here. Credit to the VA, but I'm like, it's, it's really aggravating. <laughs> Gustav. Boss of the Mimin, Keeper of the Cadaver's you Hollow. call me Gustav. See something you like? It's all yours. For a small fee, of course. <laughs> you have all this money, you couldn't buy a coat? Or pants? So, off to Tokyo Town, and you found little old me while trying. <laughs> I'll sell you what you crave. As you got the marker. <laughs> sure, man. Ew. Interesting. All right, we got our standard stuff here. Interesting that you buy elemental shards. Usually, they don't give them to you that early. Looking to buy? <laughs> Say, need anything else? <sighs> Need <Nope>. anything? <laughs> so before that, however, I'm rather taken with the human knickknacks and relics of yore. Trouble is, they're fi- and even worse. That said, if you happen to run across, also, I've taken liberty to connect. Okay. Oh yes, of course. I can use the flip, but I can't do it for free. There was an unexpected meeting. As we make our way to... <laughs> Wait, I have to... Yeah, I knew it. Save point. I'll play the game once or twice. Uh... You, know, you, have to, you have to pay money to heal. <laughs> okay, so it's two. I guess it's not that bad, but... Worth noting, I guess. <sighs> I'm so tired. Could that? I saw him before we even saw the fountain. Oh, you can do. Uh, you can change the camera during uh, talking. That's good. Bye bye. Five glory. We've located a meet. 
I think he just told me to ignore it, but I can't do that. It's gonna give me a tutorial on what glory means. I got on Meraki's essence. This is an essence. You'll want to make your merry way over to the leyline fountain. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting very uh, Darksiders vibe from this. Just like post-apocalyptic. You got a demon who's just kind of selling shit, just chilling. It's, it's, it feels very familiar. I'm also getting near vibes. I'm getting a lot of post-apocalyptic game vibes. Which makes sense. Expired soda, my favorite. Oh, interesting. It marks these on the map. I would not have thought I would have done that. Oh, I have to go around, obviously. Not my first rodeo game. Oh. Apparently, you're gonna. Make it. Man, it's Pixie. It a demon. It's dangerous to travel the netherworld alone by talking to demons. I have a lifestone you can use. Wait. If you're inside me, and I know what I said, how did you give me that lifestone? Where did I pull it from? Was it just in our pockets? Whoa, he talked to me. Could this demon want me to join him? Okay, then let's talk. I'll ask you questions. You make sure you answer in a way that makes me happy, okay? Do you think I'm cute? You're cute. Thanks. Well, let me ask you one more question. Do you want me to join you? I do. Wouldn't mind giving that a thought, but demons won't join you for free. You gotta give them all kinds of stuff, like items or mock up. Make what I want, so make sure to give that to me. Uh, I want one lifestone. Well, how convenient. Nice to meet you. Fairy Pixie. Got a healer. She might have uh, wind magic too. It's been a while. No XP for talking demons? Gross. Well done, young man. If there is a demon you want on your. I'm curious what the speedruns are for this game and stuff like that. I wonder if there's like a speedrun category for no demons. It's slime! There is a demon when confronting demons. The best strategy. On the other hand, if you observe, I again, I, I, all right. It's not really like new information to me. I know it's a joke, but like, and I know it's tutorials. So you have to do it, but I, I'm just, I'm like, I've played a video game. I, I get it. I've played games in this series, or I guess like the sister series. I genuinely think that's the same slime model as uh, Persona, but just like made to look a little grittier. Oh, well, I don't know. Interesting. Um, well, I know you're weak to fire. I don't have fire yet. Oh, the music doesn't start till you strike your first hit. That's kind of rad, actually. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. That's pretty great. So do I always go first and then the enemies go? What does the plus one mean for the uh, the lunge? I'm curious about that. Beckon you closer. What will you do? Uh, yeah, maybe I'll go closer. Get out, get out some present now. to Maka. Very well. Give me one medicine. Uh, 
a deadly amount of my HP. Uh, 90 Maka. All right. Yeah, that's tasty. Call me foul slime. <laughs> Neat. Oh, I did get experience with the slime, which is weird. Also, that's odd. Because... Wait, what? What is the essence of this supposed to do for me? Alright, anyway. Um, it's odd because I just realized, uh... Oh, wait. You are weak to everything. That's different. Huh. I guess I could just use Zeo. Um, I was gonna say it's weird that... Um, when I killed... Uh, when I killed that one, there's still another one right here. I assumed that, uh, whatever I'd be fighting would be, like, indicative in the actual battle... And on the main screen, if that makes sense. Like, I figured, oh, I fought two, so clearly it was the two in the overworld. You're so fucking done, dude. I can only do attack. Okay. I really like the music not starting until you uh, until you attack. I think it's a nice touch. It doesn't look like physical skills actually take from your HP, which is interesting. But I'm not sure yet. Yo, where's that all-out attack? Brother! Why is this bigger than mine? Seems bullshit. It's also, it's weird to me that attack is in the, uh, the skills menu. Try slime start at level one. Gross. Um, cool. So I don't choose his skills. They seem to go on their own. Yeah, we got more slimes. We got two ways to go. Let's see what's over this way. I see two demons over here I haven't seen before. So will these lead you to, like, special things, or are they just, like, there to, like, I guess just heal you when need be, recover a little bit? What the fuck was that? Why did it sound like it was behind me? I am surprised. This seems like the kind of game where if they're going to go for this, uh, this, like, open world thing, it kind of seems like they would, uh, have, like, a giant monster roaming around that you're, like, very clearly not supposed to fight yet. I don't know what these are. These are new. I don't think I've ever seen these before. I'm gonna use that item I bought. No, wait, there'll be a boss fight at some point. I'll have to use them. I guess I'll just try. I don't think they're weird twitching. Dustoma plus three. Chance of inflicting mirage to one foe. I don't know what mirage does, though. Although it is like the only thing you have, so. Oh, is that just blindness? Interesting. Oh, they're kind of giving me the business right now. All attacks, including magical attacks, become critical hits for all allies for one turn. Let's have you heal. Heal is a good amount. Oh, I fucking passed my turn like an idiot. Wow, Mirage lasted one turn. Oh, crit, great. Also, if you didn't notice it, I apologize, but these things have tiny uh, cock and balls, and that's kind of gross. 
I noticed it in the shadow, and I was like, oh no. Okay, so they're weak against fire, wind, light. This sworn slime usually learns a fire attack. Okay. Well, I guess we'll do regular attack. Critical returns and actions, that's pretty cool. Interesting. I wonder if they get easier to negotiate with if you rough them up a little bit. Oof. Oof, owie my bones. Hey man, let's let's talk this out. Yeah, I'm feeling sky high. That moon makes me feel like I can do anything. I mean, full spirits can speed you to the full moon. Let's see, you want me to join you? Let's see. You know what? I just realized I don't give a shit. Just give me some maca and we're square. 187? Yeah, man. Sure. That feels great. <laughs> I'm Haunt Prada. Good to meet you. Oh, is fairy, haunt, and foul different, like, types of monster? I'm curious. How do I revive you? I probably have to go back to the... To the healing thing. Neato. Alright, more slimes. There's an item over there. I got some more shit over here. Interesting. It's weird that they show treasure on the uh, on the map screen. I can't climb up it. No. Please. Prada's essence. Oh, so just the fucking monsters I just beat. I just got their essence. Great. That's really helpful. I appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Thank you. How long have I been going for? I've been going for 47 minutes. Uh, I'll heal up. Make sure we get a full team. And then, uh, I don't know. I thought I was going to go to the boss, but... Nah, maybe I won't. I don't know. I didn't want to do that. Naturally, uh, if it's a fair price you want, I'm good for it. <laughs> oh, interesting. So it's useful to me. Looking or to useless sell. to me, but I can <laughs> give it to them. That's funny. Need anything uh. Oh, uh, okay. Interesting. Neko Shogun is pretty early in this game, and King Frost. There's a lot. Need any you oh, it costs more when they're dead, which I guess makes sense. Okay. Um, let's see. How do I? How do I move them? Oh, here we go. Party. I mean, I've got four. Might as well use four, right? All right. Well, that uh, that seems like a good uh, good first video. I mean, first impressions are uh, it's it's uh, SMT game. <laughs> Not that that's a bad thing. It's just uh, so far some stuff that I've seen before. It seems cool. I'll probably play some more off, uh, offline. I don't think I'm going to make a whole big series out of it. Uh, but let me know in the comments if I should. If it's like one of those things. Uh, story so far, I'm just sort of like, eh. Religion stories don't really do it for me. I know that's what SMT is, uh, it's bread and butter is. Uh, but uh, yeah, let me know in the comments. Uh, Etc. And I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye bye. I love all of you.